All right, Caitlin, um, I've called you up here because <sighs> I'm doing a series inspired by when you helped me to clear out my dress collection. You have a different taste in fashion to myself and you culled yes. some things and Beck watched the episode and Beck disagreed with you on some things. Well, a lot of people disagreed with me. So then Beck was like, right. oh, Caitlin said get rid of that dress. No, 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 you should keep that. So I kept it because of what Beck said. And then I thought, you know what would be really interesting? Because all my friends have different opinions, I should do a series where I ask each friend to go in and quickly have a look at the things and yeah. anything that they think I shouldn't keep put on this clothing rack. So we started with Lucy. Lucy was episode one. Yeah. So I, I came back in and uh, Lucy had a rack of things for me. And everyone in episode one saw the things that Lucy pulled out and thought yeah. I shouldn't keep. I've, we've put them back in now. We've re-amalgamated them in with the rest mm. of the wardrobe. So if there's any items that just keep popping up over and over again, they're definitely going. Now, I did actually get rid of some things that Lucy put on the rack just immediately. I was like, don't put them back in. Okay. I, I completely agree. They can just go. So there's no point in me putting those back because I've already made up my mind that I don't need to keep them. The question, right? I'm culling these based on what I think you shouldn't own anymore. Like, Is that what you did? Like, it's not necessarily... Hello, I'm still here. Yeah, <laughs> come back in episode one. Come on. <laughs> um, I did it based on basically combo of stuff where I was like, I don't think you need... Like, for example, there was one of the things that we definitely got rid of was Alex had two very similar green coats. And okay. I knew she liked one more than the other. And I was yeah. like, they serve the same purpose in your wardrobe, you don't need to. I was like, keeping Alex in mind, what I know, like, there are some things where I'm like, yeah. oh, she loves that jumper. So I'm not gonna suggest you get rid all of it. All I know that she likes is like, what she's wearing, like, big t shirts. <laughs> That's all I know that she likes. Just put it in time lapse. Full disclaimer, mode, whatever I pick. Uh, this is not a commentary on anyone else's design or aesthetic preferences. This is purely me just going blah, 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 blah. But before we tackle the wardrobe, let's thank today's sponsor, HelloFresh. HelloFresh is a subscription meal kit that delivers easy to follow recipes and fresh pre-portioned ingredients that are ready to cook right to your front door. There's no time wasted because you don't have to hop in the car and go grocery shopping. There's no food wasted because the food is all pre-portioned into the exact quantities you need for your recipe. There's dozens of recipes to choose from each week and most take only 30 minutes and some take 20 minutes or less with their quick and easy options. There's low carb, low cal, vegetarian and pescatarian options with fully customizable portion sizes and delivery dates. You can skip a week whenever you want and best of all, HelloFresh is sustainable. Their packaging is either fully recyclable or it's made from recycled materials. Go to hellofresh.com and use code prettypastel18 for 18 free meals plus free shipping. That's hellofresh.com using my code prettypastel18 for 18 free meals and free shipping. You know what? Screw it. I oh, no, I'm just gonna say I hate everything if I do that. I need to draw a line somewhere. I don't like this, but that doesn't mean Alice doesn't like this. I don't want to give a reason for why. I just, I just, I, it depends what it looks like on her, right? I don't know what she looks like in this. Eh, screw it. It's got like these little furly bits, right? It'll make you look like a giant triangle. I've never seen her wear this in my life. Okay, this part, this part, adorable, really, really nice. This part is a sin. I hate this. I hate it. I hate it. You know what? No. You have to take this whole thing off if you ever want to go pee. Because it's like... Alright, so much of but there's no way to pee through this. You have to take the whole thing off. Like sleeves. What if you... I've seen her layer this, right? Like put things on top. You can't pee in that. Functional disaster. No. Uh, no. Okay. Um, I don't know if this is unnecessary for me to say that I, I work as a graphic designer. I know that's not really that big of a deal. It really isn't actually any kind of, any kind of point of authority actually. But this is heinous. This is more of a sin than the other one. This, this is probably the worst thing. Who makes this chains and... I don't even know. The, the, the flappy, the flappy, materially, liney, not... Oh, I wanted to like this. I bought her that, that ungrateful blank. You know, you fill in the blanks for me. I bought her this, I, I want to own this. I tried putting it on before I gave it to her. Cause I was like, maybe I'll keep it. <laughs> uh, I don't, 
I'm saying goodbye because um, I hate this. I would have kept it if it was just the rest of the stuff. I could look over it, I could think of it, but this, this is heinous. It's thick though. You know, I'll keep that. You just wear it like a regular big t-shirt and it makes it kind of like cool looking. You know? And it gives you warmth. Oh, it's a matching set. I don't know if I like it as a matching set. I don't like this as much. Can I take, I can't, I can't split the set, can I? Maybe she'll let me get away with it. This feels like that, like a, like a well-worn washcloth. I hate the neck. Let's, let's go. All right. I know I said something bad about this one last time. She will have other opportunities to get nicer ones of this. Oh no, she would hate the shoulders on that. Itchy, itchy. See, it was just kind of like that. I would, but like this. Who does this? It's almost cool matrix vibe. Like, like that. Oh, don't want to see how much it is. It's bad, but it's, it could have been worse. Gets me better. This is the Alicia dress in peach, peach color, I think, from House of CB. Am I right? Yes. I wanted to get. The, I put this dress on right um, ages ago, and when she was doing another video, right, I tried to put it on. Didn't fit me, right? So I looked it up on the House of CB. Two hundred bucks. That's really expensive. I can't do that. But I kept looking at it. I was like, maybe. Maybe. And then they took it down. They made it unavailable and they put up all these other pattern stuff. And I don't like patterns, right? I like, I like the colors, I like the solid colors. And I truly like dogged them for about a couple months. And eventually they, and they came back in stock. And now it's back in stock. I'm still just looking at it. So I really like this, but I don't know if she really likes it. T-shirt, like a mullet shirt. Heavy but bad. No wait, here you go. You get to live on here now. Her mom would wear this. That's what I feel. Nah. It's another house of CB dress, but nah. Oh, it feels nice though. But nah. <sighs> I hate these. I hate these. I hate these things. Like, okay, I, I don't mind them on the back of a dress, but you need to have like a little more elastic. But the whole thing, you have you have more budget than that. The hell is this? Wait, she has one of these already. Oh, okay. She has two. This one makes you look like an old lady. This one's kind of cute. Where'd the rest of the skirt go? Is this a skirt? What is this? What is this thing? Someone explain this to me. What is this? Is this a shirt? Oh, this girl. Is this girl on TikTok? Who made me learn about the thing that is schneed, schnood, schneed, or it's just a thing that you can wear multiple ways. If you can wear this in a cool way, you get to keep it. If you can't, this is like upholstery you'd see in a cheap car. Why did you do this? You would sweat so much in this. No, it's, I don't know if you can hear it, but. You know when you sit in a leather car seat and like, a car. Uh, yeah, yeah. Sit in the leather car seat, whatever. You sit down and you're wearing shorts and your like cheeks get stuck to the car seat and you get back up and you hear like it rip up. Yeah, no. It's asymmetrical. I don't like it. The back. Pants. Pants. Is it flares? I like flares. That's the wrong person to have. <laughs> oh, oh no. Uh, <laughs> these are squares. I don't know. I don't care if it's pretty. It's short. You'd never feel safe again in that. Boring. Gross. No sleeves. No, this is like a vest. If you wore this, you'd be cold. It has no sleeves, so therefore you're colder. I don't like it. Stupid. <laughs> Why did she buy this? Why did she buy this? Why did she buy this? Why would she do that to herself? See, I see these being sold all the time and I'm like, oh, it's expensive. Then part of my monkey brain goes, it's expensive, it must be good. I think I would just prefer to pet a dog. I don't want it to stop going, but no, not big bird today. Why did you 
can't you just get like one good black? Oh boy. I'm, I'm pressing the physics. It's fine, stay in there, it's fine. I know. You got a balloon already. How long have we been going on for? It's like, this is so awful. Is it expensive? Oh, it still has a tag on it. Uh, okay. I hate it. I did it. She has enough stuff. There aren't enough opportunities for going out to wear these things when she has obviously more superior other things she could be wearing. Therefore, yeet this, don't know, get, give it to opportunity someone else to get it, they might like it. Because like, some of this stuff is like fancy ass brands, right? Fancy ass brands. Fancy ass brands don't always make the nicest stuff. Like they just make things. For the purposes of being you and hip, like I get it, right? You're designing, you gotta keep designing, be irrelevant. But some of the stuff is bad. And you shouldn't just want things because it's expensive and it's a good name. I can understand wanting something if it's a good material because then it's like, feels not, I've, good material stuff just feels nice, right? But like, if it's just, if it just looks bad. I don't like blazers. Wait. Oh. I hate chains. Oh, I can't say that. I hate, ooh. Does Alex hate chains? What is this? Is this the bell? Is it a fancy brand? Oh, it kind of is. Why am I like this? This is a wedding dress. Who would ever wear this? I was getting married in it. Greek. Go oh, that's probably why I chose the black one, huh? I like it better. Don't like it that much though. Oh, does she like this? Does she like this? I hate this. Does she like this? Oh, it's so short. No. Do you want to live in the pastel cage? All right, I'm done. I'm done. This isn't it, is it? Yes. This is get rid of the pile. Yeah. They're joking. <laughs> no, I'm dead serious. Come on, we're at schedule. Let's go. Are you kidding me? No, I'm not actually. I genuinely think that it's a lavender cage. I've never seen you wear it. Why would you wear it? it sounds horrible. Get rid of it. You absolutely not. Look how short it is. Absolutely not. Your coochie would be open to the world. I've worn it around. It's it was your coochie open to the world? No, it was not. Then I'm amazed. Okay. This it's Dion Lee. It's so what? Like, it's got like weird it. chains on it. It's weird. Uh, okay, I have never worn this Nicola Fanetti dress. It's a wedding dress, all right. There's a story behind this, but I should indeed get rid of it. It's um not real Zimmerman. Um, I paid a lot of money for something that turned out to be fake. Oh. I'm not getting rid of this. This is poster girl, and I really like Look this. Look at the resolution quality of the imagery on this thing. It is blurry. Even the graphics design. It is have blurry. You know, I got featured in Vogue. Wearing this, you know what? You, when I was at Fashion Week, then you could Vogue. get you could get featured in Vogue wearing anything then. <laughs> nope, I had this and then I sold it on Depop and then I missed it so much that I bought it again. Do you know how often you go outside when it's cold? Almost no, no. no I at stalked all. the Facebook Marketplace for two years trying to find this. I put two blue ones over there already. You don't need three. I don't mind getting rid of Big Bird. For quotes, right? It makes me ill. Like, I don't necessarily mind the idea, but like, I could never think about, you know, making it look good. It's like, I don't know how I would get away with wearing it. Yes. Yes! You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. Look at this! That is not a defense. <laughs> so you wore it once, and then it gets look worse than I've worn it multiple times. Oh, no. Well, then it's less great. Wait, what brand is that? Uh, Y Project. This is Alex Higgins, yeah. University of Technology Sydney fashion graduate that's friends with my friend. I have a degree too! It doesn't mean anything! <laughs> this, yeah, I've never worn that brand new attack. Yeah, get rid of the car seat. Did that. I How do you wear this? How do you wear this? Those, this goes around your thighs. Oh! It was actually worn by, uh, like, one of the black pink girls. I like it more um, now. I didn't know. I, I just looked at it yeah, and was your, like, your, I'm confused. Your legs go through these holes. So it looks like it, um, and that one wraps around your waist. So ah. it just, um, but I actually, I wanted to return this, but the returns window expired. So I did actually want to get rid of it. You have two of these. Um, I have two of what? One's shorter though. 
That's a dress. Yeah. This is a pantsuit. Well, you know what? It looked a bit like a dress and this was cuter anyway. Well, I wore this to an event and they took lots of photos of me. <sighs> you know what? I'm going to make a pile of oh. things that Lucy also you... said, you know. Do you disagree with us? Yes. Another one that you both said. Lucy said that one and she said that one and she said that one and she said that we... one and she said that one. I was helping to set up this video and I thought it'd be interesting to put all of the stuff that was in the maybe pile on one same rack. And I noticed that nothing, basically all of that rack you put on the rack. Most of my thoughts were, I like the leather one, right? The leather dress. That, that's got a weird, it's got a goopy neck. Um, I was thinking leather dress, it's right? <laughs> Scanlon Theodore, two piece crepe do knit. You, well, do you want to look like a 50 year old? It looks that's amazing it. on me. I don't look good in much, but this looks amazing on me. <laughs> Wrong and Sure. You look good in lots of things. Why would you get rid of the skirt and not the matching top? Well, I picked up the top first and went, this is a cool vest. I like this vest. Then I picked up the skirt and went, but I don't like the skirt though. I keep the vest, but I don't like the skirt. And I ha I stayed true to my soul. All right. I, I, I don't like them together. I would not keep them unless I had them both together. I did feel a bit Are hesitant about that. Are you joking? That. This is vintage made in France. This is so cool. Does uh, that matter to me? Louis Vuitton. It doesn't matter what it is. A, an authentic, Look brand new this. Louis Vuitton t-shirt that never I bought worn it. from Louis Vuitton. You never worn it. Because the weather wasn't warm enough. It's got weird necklace thing. It's grotty. It's made in Italy. I'm... That, I thrifted that. It's Scanlon Theodore, it can go. I thrifted this vintage Scanlon Theodore. It looks Theodore. like a grade nine textiles project. Not even 12, grade nine. Don't like that. Dion Lee. I like this. I don't, oh, I mean the chains. I just don't like chains. I don't like My marine sea cat suit! How do you pee in it? You, you don't. <laughs> this is not a dress, this is a top. Yeah. I love long tops because they cover my lack of an ass. This is also Alex Higgins. Oh, that was the worst one. No. Don't, don't. That is the worst. Look Alex at that. Higgins. Look at the typography on that. It's I vile. love that. It reminds me of praying. No. If anyone likes the brand praying. God, it's like it's like early GeoCity. It's so slay to me. It's like it's like a word document and all the words have gone blah, blah, blah. I love it! Hulk Gaia. Sorry guys. Asymmetrical. I love this dress. Asymmetrical. Big um, neck. Dior. This is a Dior. See, I this like is a <laughs> This is a vintage Chanel dress! The best old vintage Chanel dress! <laughs> I would be okay with you keeping that one. Just get rid of that. Get rid of that now. Really? Ah, weird look fake corsetti bits. With like ribbon, like come I'll, on. I'll try that. If you want to keep it, I guess. But you have this one, which is vaguely the same silhouette, and I was like, this one's better. That one is also six hundred dollars cheaper. <laughs> that one's better. A lot of my reasoning was, you're already filling in. Like these are all have opportunities for encounters, right? Like yeah. I'm going out for dinner, or I'm going to see someone cool, or I'm going to be going cold. You already have clothing that fulfills that that you already like more. <laughs> well, um, that's it. Thank you, Caitlin. Uh, as always, your savagery is a true delight to witness. Uh, please, as a disclaimer, know Alex's feelings were harmed in the making of this film. With that, thank you, Caitlin. Um, should I promote your YouTube channel? Are you gonna ever come back? Like me, just like me, audience. That's all I want. I feed off your energy and it makes me happy. I'll put her link down below and then you guys can bully her into making a video. Can I share that someone? Who? Joe and Wade from PAX, you were really cool. Thanks for hanging out with me. I love you guys. Aww. Yeah, that was my first person, like second, second person who in real life saw me was like, oh, it's Caitlin. And then she immediately was kind of like grace to me. She was kind of like, you haven't put a video up in like, like a couple <laughs> months. Why is that, huh? And I'm like, oh, I'm sorry. And she was like, well, you know what? It's going to happen. You're going to become like irrelevant. Like you really should like, keep doing stuff. I'm like, I know. And then we became friends. So you know, like a million people have watched that Shein video of us together, right? Like a million people. I actually didn't know that. <laughs> I stopped checking it after I hit like 100. I was like, that's too much effort, 100k. I was like, ah, I can't, I gotta go. That's so funny. I haven't looked at it in a while. Okay, thank you so much. And stay tuned for part three yeah. when Beck will be culling the wardrobe. Beck's really, uh, she's yes. gonna be really diplomatic. Thank you guys yeah. so much for watching. I will see you next time. Mwah! Is that how I do my intro? I kind of forgot. <laughs> so thank my you outro. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. No, that was good. Keep that one. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>